all right guys so welcome back to another brand new video so in this video i want to talk more about bitcoin and why right now is the biggest opportunity right now to buy into bitcoin but not just bitcoin even your favorite altcoins okay altcoins right now okay are in fact dirt cheap okay i've been you know telling us that many many times and i'm pretty sure you know we can all agree on that right you guys understand majority of these old coins okay that are in fact in the crypto market right now okay are down significantly okay from where they were back in 2021 you know when they were in fact at its all-time high okay and we weren't obviously in a you know bull market compared to where they are now right a lot of these old coins are nowhere near back up to the previous all-time highs back in 2021 including bitcoin Okay, so in this video, guys, I really want to talk about that. Why? Okay, you know, reasons, you know, to buy Bitcoin and your favorite old coins right now at this very moment. Because I've been telling us many times right now, we should be buying as much as we possibly can. We should be stacking. And most importantly, we should be, you know, dollar cost averaging, right? We all should be at least DCAing into crypto. Okay, and of course, a disclaimer. This is obviously not financial advice, guys. So always, okay, understand that and please always do your own research. But yes, we know Bitcoin right now is still holding at $26,000 ever, ever since we had that drop for Bitcoin. It's just been consolidating um, at 26 k right? And the crypto market is not really moving today. In fact, it's actually down uh, almost 2% today, right? You guys can see that. So Bitcoin is dumping. Well, it's not dumping, but it's dipping. Uh, Ethereum is dipping as well as of right now, and a fair few old coins are in fact dropping even more compared to where they were yesterday. Now, yesterday, yes, we saw the crypto market actually gaining momentum. Okay, it was in fact slightly pumping, right? We saw a fair few old coins pump, including Bitcoin. Um, but today it seems like it's you know slightly having another you know pullback, right? Just slightly, nothing too crazy though, right? Uh, but yes, let's begin, guys. So I really want to show you guys this okay the bitcoin yearly candles so pretty much guys you know happens every four years we know the halving pretty much happens every four years okay and you know those four year time periods we enter a bear market and of course you know a bull market right so we enter a bear market and a bull market two different cycles so it seems like every th three years okay every three years we have our uh, green years right where we see bitcoin and the crypto market you know pumping and whatnot and we have one year that is in fact in the rest so you guys could see 2011 2012 and 2013 were in fact you know green years where we saw bitcoin you know performing not too not too shabby not too bad right just cryptocurrency in general um and you guys could see 2014 that's when we saw you know everything pretty much crashing back down because we were in fact entering the next cycle you know the bear market and then 2015 2016 to 2017 we know especially 2017 right that year was massive for bitcoin especially because we saw bitcoin pump all the way up to like uh close to twenty thousand dollars right who remembers back in 2017 i believe that year i felt like that's when a lot of people you know fomoed into bitcoin that's when a lot of people start started to you know talk more about bitcoin right in 2017 and then of course 2018 okay we saw bitcoin absolutely crashing and then 2019 and 2020 and of course 2021 we know what happened we saw bitcoin pumping so right now Okay, 2022 last year in previous years, right? In previous uh, year, we saw Bitcoin pretty much crashing, right? And I really, you know, do believe that 2022 was literally one of the worst, not the worst, but it was literally one of the worst bear markets ever. Okay, literally, like if you survived 2022, if you're simply just hodling right throughout that year, you can literally survive anything, right? I've been telling you that many, many times. Bitcoin was absolutely crashing. The market was absolutely crashing and that year alone so much fud has happened that's why we saw you know uh the crypto market absolutely collapsing right we saw a fair few you know crypto exchanges right pretty much going bankrupt and just shut down completely we saw for example uh celsius uh i think it was, there was one called blockfi and the big one was ftx right we know that okay so yeah a fair few you know crypto exchanges then in fact shut down and that's what caused the crypto market to crash. And also a big one, we saw Terra Luna, right? Who remembers? 
last year in May of 2022, we saw Terra Luna absolutely collapsing and that caused the crypto market to crash massively. So in January 2022 was just a terrible year. And here we are in 2023 and we are in fact seeing Bitcoin slowly recover. And of course, the next few years, of course, two years, I'm talking about, you know, 2024 to 2025, those years are going to be absolutely amazing for Bitcoin and crypto. Okay, so 2024 should be really interesting. And of course, 2025 should be absolutely amazing for Bitcoin. So be ready for that, guys. Okay, be ready for that. Okay. Now, let's talk more about why you guys should be buying Bitcoin right now. Why right now is the biggest opportunity, okay, to buy Bitcoin and of course, your favorite altcoins. So we know the fear and greed index right now, okay, is in fact in fear mode. Okay, just recently, ever since we had this crash, okay, Bitcoin was, you know, it was in fact in neutral and then it turned into uh, fear mode, right? Ever since that collapse didn't in fact happen for Bitcoin and crypto. So yes, clearly right now, we are in fact in fear. Yesterday was in fact in fear, last week was in fear and last month we were in fact in neutral. So I told you guys many times, while others are fearful, we should be greedy. So right now is the perfect time to buy guys. Okay, it is in fact the perfect opportunity right now to buy. Dollar cost average now could be the smartest move for you guys right now at this very, very moment. While everyone else is panicking and panic selling for no reason, we should be doing, you know, we should be doing the complete opposite and be greedy and buy, right? And stack and DCA, of course. Okay. So while everyone else is fearful, we should be greedy, right? So that's that. So right now, is the perfect time to buy Bitcoin. And here's also another reason I actually showed you guys this chart, uh, I think it was like two days ago. Yeah, about two days ago. So this right here in front of you guys is the Bitcoin uh, daily RSI. And you guys can see it has in fact reached, um, you know, it's low once again. So you guys can see last time it reached its low, it was back in 2020. Uh, actually at the COVID crash, right? So when COVID hit, okay, obviously we had the COVID crash and that's when we saw Bitcoin collapsing and you guys clearly see um, it did in fact reach, um, the RSI did in fact reach that low level once again and we haven't had it ever since, right? So obviously right now since, um, you know, we did in fact reach this low level once again, it's obviously a good time to buy Bitcoin, right? So it seems like it's being oversold and whatnot. So right now is the perfect time to buy Bitcoin if you guys really think about it, okay? And I told you guys many times, if you guys really look at the Bitcoin chart, okay, if I show you guys here on uh, trading view, go to the weekly time frame, you guys can see, Bitcoin is nowhere near back up to its previous all-time high. It's not even halfway there yet. Understand, yes, you know, we did in fact hit a bottom. Bitcoin did in fact reach a bottom. And Bitcoin is in fact slowly forming a new pattern up to the upside, right? You guys can see that from its previous low all the way down here. So understand guys, right, right now is still the perfect time to buy Bitcoin. Okay, Bitcoin is not even halfway there to reach and back up to its previous highs. And, you know, we are still in bear conditions. You know, I wouldn't say we are in fact 100% in a bull market just yet, but this is, okay, I will say this, this is obviously, you know, the beginning of the next bull market, but not, we're not 100% there just yet, guys, right? We know a lot of old coins are still down. None of these altcoins are back up to their previous all-time highs, not even, you know, close to it, right? So understand that, guys, it's still a good time to buy Bitcoin, okay? It really, really is. And I really want you guys, you know, to understand that, right? So that's that. Now, yes, we hit bottom, okay? Yes, clearly see that, okay? And now Bitcoin is, in fact, having the next green wave up to the upside. We know the Bitcoin halving is obviously right around the corner, literally a few months away, from the halving event, okay, around like eight months from now. So literally not that long, literally less than a year from now. So time is ticking, guys. Please understand this, right? You literally have less than a year to buy Bitcoin at a decent price. And I'm telling you guys right now, if you guys haven't seen my most previous video, okay, you guys should definitely check it out. But I told you guys in that video, you know, I talked about Bitcoin reaching at least 50K towards the end of this year. And I really do believe that will in fact happen. I do in fact see a 50K Bitcoin towards the end of this year okay so you might as well buy as much bitcoin right now while it's still at twenty six thousand dollars while it's still below 30k guys okay bitcoin is a great long-term investment and investing into bitcoin right now at 26k for long term 
is a great long-term investment, okay? Because we know where Bitcoin is heading, right, in the next bull market. We know it's going to easily reach back up to its previous highs, which is around 69K, okay? And it's going to reach on your all-time all -time high, right? We know that. So understand, guys, Bitcoin will obviously reach on your all-time high. It's going to easily reach 100K, okay, six figs. It's going to easily potentially reach 150K, and I do, in fact, see Bitcoin reaching at least 200K in the next bull market, guys. Okay, so you guys clearly see the next green wave is, in fact, forming right now. We have already hit bottom and Bitcoin is slowly forming um, the next bull cycle, right? So be excited for that. And we should not be panicking at all. This is not the time to be panicking, right? We should be very, very bullish for Bitcoin right now, guys. Okay, so yes, I understand Bitcoin, okay, this is where Bitcoin's gonna be in the next few months. So yes, 50K is very, very possible. And of course, 2024, right, the halving, of course, that is when we're gonna see Bitcoin really, really pump. So I want you guys to really, you know, be prepared for that, guys, because trust me, a massive pump is coming for Bitcoin. Even though, yes, Bitcoin seems like it's gonna dump. And yes, we could potentially see Bitcoin dump even more back down to like 25 to 24 to 23, maybe, right, who knows? But I really do believe this is going to be the last shakeout for Bitcoin, you know, this last dip. And then we're going to see Bitcoin absolutely pump up to the upside, guys. OK, it's going to have uh, more pumps coming for this year in 2023. So talking about that, the Bitcoin monthly returns you asked to see so far this month in August <clears throat> are down 10.9 percent. At one point, it was actually close to 12 percent. OK, so overall, this month in august has been a terrible month for bitcoin right and we will potentially most likely end off this month okay we'll end this month in the reds okay because you guys understand uh we have literally less than a week left into this month okay like six days left so we will most likely end off this month um in the reds and of course september okay i talked about this a fair bit we know september usually that month Bitcoin does not perform that great. You guys can see for six years straight, literally six years straight for September, Bitcoin has just been forming not that great, right? You guys can clearly see that. So for next month in September, I'm not expecting anything too big for Bitcoin. I think we will potentially see, you know, the month of September, right? We're going to see Bitcoin potentially, you know, drop further down to the downside, most likely, okay? But I understand October, October, usually Bitcoin does perform pretty well, okay? So I'm still sticking with it. You know, I still believe, you know, Bitcoin will reach at least 50K towards the end of this year, guys. Okay, I still believe in that, right? I really, really do. So we will see, but that is just my personal prediction. But guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, okay? I just really wanted to, you know, talk more about this, okay? And why we should be buying as much Bitcoin as of right now. And of course, your favorite altcoins. Because they are still low, guys. Please understand this. Bitcoin and your favorite altcoins, okay, their prices, okay, are so much lower compared to where they were in the last bull market. And they're still low, right? Bitcoin and a lot of these altcoins are still nowhere near, you know, its previous all-time high. So obviously, it's still a great buy right now. We know Bitcoin is going to pump. You know, the Bitcoin halving is right around the corner. We know old season is obviously right around the corner as well. So Bitcoin's going to absolutely skyrocket. And of course, all coins are going to absolutely skyrocket as well. So I really want you guys to, you know, be prepared for that. If you want to make money in crypto, you better take advantage right now of these prices and take the biggest opportunity right now in crypto to make that money. And of course, a disclaimer, once again, this is not financial advice, guys. Okay, so always do your own research. But please look at the charts and understand where Bitcoin is heading next, guys. Okay, just look at it, right? So that's that. But guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. I will in fact be going live later on today, so stay tuned for that. And I'll catch you guys all in my next video. Have a good one, guys.